everyone. everyone. Well, it has been an incredibly busy six months with the book. And I've been at work since the pandemic started. We needed a little getaway. So we are here at the Santa Barbara Botanic Gardens. Being outdoors always refreshes and recharges us. So we want to bring you guys along as we explore the outdoors. Now this is the nation's first botanic garden and it really focuses on native plants in the area. Wow, I never knew that. <gasps> I've never been either, we've never been here. Look at these gorgeous flowers. Oh my gosh, the pinks are amazing and all the bees buzzing around. Cool. Now you guys might know or might not know that it's always good to grow some native plants to your area. They're gonna grow well in uh, whatever climate you live in. So it'll be really fun to check these out today and maybe get some new ideas for the garden. So many little pathways to explore yeah, here. I didn't know they had all this here. This is so cute. I have to thank my niece Angelica for showing us this part of the park. I never knew this was here. I know I keep saying that over and over. Yeah, these are redwoods. That's Northern California. I love this little bench here. <sighs> Perfect little spot here in the shade. Guys, this is so gorgeous. I never knew this was here before all my life. I never knew this was here. We're gonna walk you guys through right now and we're not gonna say anything. We're just gonna let you listen. Here we go. You know how I always mulch with shredded leaves and pine needles? This is mulch heaven right here. Nature's best mulch. This is such a pretty little spot. This is wild ginger and it looks beautiful. It's all wet from the irrigation. Now I thought it was interesting that they're irrigating this area, but it totally makes sense because we have no water here in California. So to get all this to look as green as it is, they've got to have irrigation going. By far, this is just absolutely gorgeous here. So relaxing. So relaxing, so peaceful, and it's just so fun to look at all the plants. Look at that. They are incredible. Look at this, grapevines. Oh, cool. This is the Children's Centennial Maze. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. This arch, I love garden arches. Let's see if I can find my way out. Don't get lost in the maze. This is here in the trail. I don't see rattles on the on it though. I'm not so sure it's a rattlesnake, but it's some kind of big old rattlesnake. Well, I kind of figured, yeah, I'm not gonna take chances. We're going the other way. See his head? Oh yeah, I can see its head. Blends right in with the brush. There's no rattles. It's gotta be some other type of snake. Yeah, I, I don't know what kind of, I don't, I would think it would have been rattling at us if it were a rattler. Yeah. But I'm so glad she warned us, the hiker before us stepped right over it. It's beautiful on its back, it's kind of orange, orange stripes. We have our GoPro with a long stick, so don't worry, we're not getting too close to it. He is just sitting still in stealth mode. Let's just get. Yeah. <gasps> oh gosh. Pretty cool here. I had no idea this was here. A house in the background with all kinds of examples of drought tolerant landscaping, native grasses, native plants, lots of mulch. Don't need a lot of water. Let mulch work for you. Keeps the soil moist and cool, helps the water. Check. Soak in, reduces Check. runoff, suppresses weeds. Check. This Looks attractive, so cool. creates a healthy living soil, increased soil fertility, decreased soil compaction. Oh my gosh, <laughs> we need one of these at our house, Jerry. Ours is child's play compared to this thing. When it rains, it stores. I love how it just fits up against the side of the house. Oh my gosh, everybody. 
Wow, it takes 3.5 inches of rain falling to fill this tank. It all runs down from the roof. Oh, how pretty. Look at this little pergola. Oh. These are California wild grapes. Jerry, can we do something like this in our backyard? Yes. Look at the grapes. Now that is a real grapevine arch. <laughs> Uh oh, I'm in trouble. It's a nursery. Yes. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. These are gorgeous. Yeah, they are. A bell fountain. I've never seen that before. I like it. Thanks a lot for hanging out with us today, guys. It was a very relaxing and peaceful day. I really feel recharged. Yeah, it was really nice. Thanks for coming along and take care of yourselves as well. We take the time to do that. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see, see you on the next, next video. video.